is Nikki Oliver. I live in Plymouth, Minnesota with my son Giovanni. I grew up in North Minneapolis. My mother was a drug addict and alcoholic. My dad raised me and my sister as a single father. Those things were really difficult. When senior year came around, I met this guy. When I became pregnant, I had just started college. So it was like, oh, what do I do now? So I had to stay in this house with this relationship that turned abusive. I worked overnights and then went to school during the day full time. Gio's the only child being in these rough environments. It was really hard to, to focus when you didn't have a stable housing or you had to go back to a home environment was, that was just too chaotic. Women talk a lot about having grown up in communities where they've experienced trauma related to violence or addiction and instability of having to uh, move around a lot. They have less to give to their children, and so the children sort of internalize that, feeling like there really isn't much beyond where they are. There is a brick wall. When I first heard about the Jeremiah program, I knew it was a good opportunity for me and my child. Jeremiah program serves single mothers and children. It's a two-generational model that combines safe, affordable housing, quality early childhood education, life skill development and empowerment within a supportive community. In 1998, we started with 18 families. Over the years, Jeremiah Program has served over 1,700 families in five states. We're tackling the external barriers that our families face through things like safe and affordable housing. But we also tackle the internal barriers that our moms are facing personally. And that's really done through empowerment. We use life skills and empowerment training to really develop the soft skills of the mothers so that they are well equipped to deal with whatever life's challenges might be. Empowerment taught us how to manage the struggles we had in life. They gave us tools for parenting, tools to manage ourself. That's something that has really transformed in me is being more confident and vocal and standing up for me. Um, and I wasn't doing that before. The transformation that I've personally seen in families is magical. You see them find their voice. You can tell that they are empowered. Our moms are teaching their children the same things that they're learning as they're going through the program. By taking this multi-generational approach, we really feel like we have the best shot at breaking these families out of the cycle of poverty. Now I am the manager of grants and government relations for the Minnesota Office of Higher Education. Gio's in the fifth grade and he's in the top 90% of his class. Now we're in a new apartment. Jeremiah provided that secure, safe place. It was set up there for us to succeed and for our children to succeed. If I didn't find out about Jeremiah, I may have ended up in a shelter I might still be in that horrible relationship. I can't even imagine where I would be, to be honest, if I didn't find Jeremiah. Jeremiah program is a solution that will have a sustainable impact of success for families. We are really dedicated to this mission of transforming families two generations at a time.